keep teaching you how to use Windows Live Movie Maker. From previous lesson, we learned we need to import the image files and the video files first. So let's import this. Select this, drag, drag it to the editing area. Okay, I want to put those two items in the right sequence. Let's put in this way. So let's move this one to the last part. Okay, now let's learn how to edit your video. You can use the zoom in and the zoom out function. Let's preview this video first. Three, two, one, action. Okay. Because at the beginning of the video, I have some countdowns. I don't want this part. So I want to delete this part. How? We go to the edit tab, click the split video. Click it. So you will split this video segment into two parts. I don't want the first part so you can select this and uh, push the delete key and uh, keep watching it computer lab Three, two. Mm, not bad now let's preview the first video do the same thing Three, two, one, action I pause and uh, go to the edit tab click split I don't want this part the beginning part so I select this and the delete let's preview this again textbook hmm pretty good now let's learn how to edit your image files easy for example, I want to edit the photo one JPEG. This the first image. Let's go to the visual effects. Select the effects you like. How about this one? So just click it. Let's edit the last photo image. Let's choose one. Maybe this one. Hmm, not bad. Okay, you can also change the brightness. See that? Hmm. Okay, let's do it this way. Okay, now let's learn how to add transitions to your video. Select the video segment, go to the animations tab. Right there, you will find transitions. At the beginning, there's no transitions. Choose the transition you like. You can click more arrow to find the transition you like. Okay, now preview it. Hmm. Compute. Now, let's choose another transition for the second video. This one. Preview it. Okay, you can also apply transitions to your pictures too. Same, go to the animations tab. Just choose this one. Preview it. Okay. Sometimes I want to apply multiple transitions or multiple effects to one picture or one video. How to do that? Let's take this picture as an example. We go to the visual effects. Click more arrow. Scroll down. Right there you will find multiple effects. Let's 
because I just applied black and white yellow filter to this image let's insert add more effects let's say fade in from white add and fade out to the white add fade in comes up before fade out right so let's move this move down apply take a look fade in from white and fade out right hmm. now let's learn how to add a title to your video it's easy first of all you need to click the first segment of your video and you will see the cursor stops from at the very beginning and you go to the home tab go to the add group right there you will find title let's click title from there you can edit a title let's say type it now if you want to you can select different effects look here click more arrow for example you like this one okay click it and done okay now let's learn how to insert caption something like subtitle easy for example I want to insert a subtitle to this video segment go to the home tab go to the caption right there you can enter your text there let's say okay so when I preview it you will see computer, computer lab. lab okay how could I go back and uh, re-edit this subtitle you double click it you will see this you can move the subtitle or the caption to the right place and uh, you can apply different effects to this subtitle for example let's select this one I click the outside borders click it and go to the format go to the effects choose one cool subtitle for it hmm? see easy okay let's add another subtitle so click this one go to the caption I can highlight it bold font change the font size right move the curves move the move the subtitle to the right place I can apply effect to the subtitle let's choose this one okay preview it textbook of course we can add credit to the end of the video too how go to the home tab and click the credit you can choose difference for example I'm the director I choose director and directed by type your name easy okay and uh, let's see we can go to the home tab again choose credit hmm location okay let's click location enter location here let's type and choose apply uh, effects to it
Sometimes we would like the audience to see the subtitles or the captions at right time. We need to go back and change the timing, the timeline. How could we do that? For example, let's choose this one. So I want you to click this one, double click it. You will see the computer lab. You can go to the start time or the text duration, change the time duration. Let's see, change it to three seconds. And change this one. Uh, let's take a look. Textbook. Hmm. Okay, so I click this. Change the time duration. Okay, you can change the starting time too. Let's see. Okay. And two seconds duration two second so uh, let's preview it textbook mm. now let's learn how to save the project file you go to the the bar click the button save project save to the desktop okay so the project you can rename it prod and save that's it thank you for your watching bye bye